me show you how to create this dispersion effect in Photoshop. Let's start by creating a new file, size 1920 by 1080 pixels. You can download the images from the link in the description below. Duplicate the image by dragging it to this icon. Let's name this layer Liquify. And this layer, let's name it Main Image. Add a layer mask. Choose the brush tool. Let's open the brushes by going to Window, Brushes. Now check the description for the brush that we will use. When you download the brush, you just have to double click on it and it will be inside Brushes tab right here. Open the folder and let's choose this brush. You can change the size of the brush from here. Let's make it a little bit smaller. This is the brush number that I am using. From here, you can rotate the brush as you want. Set the foreground color to black. Let's rotate the brush like this. Set the opacity and the flow to 100%. Follow this process. Rotate the brush and adjust its size accordingly. To try Adobe Photoshop, press the first link in the description below. You can also use the arrow keys on your keyboard to rotate the brush. Now let's unhide this layer. Go to Filter and choose Liquify. Choose this Forward Wrap tool. We're going to exaggerate this part. Follow along these steps. You can support my channel by hitting the subscribe button. When you finish, press OK. Hold Alt and click on the mask to create an inverted mask. Now we can't see anything from this layer. We will use the brush that we have used before to show parts of this layer. Set the foreground color to white. Press F5 to show and hide the brush properties. Rotate the brush and adjust its size accordingly. Follow this process. You can also use the arrow keys on your keyboard to rotate the brush. You can use the bracket keys to make the brush bigger or smaller. Follow this process. If you have any questions, write them below and I will reply to you as soon as possible. To try Adobe Photoshop, press the first link in the description below. Here's the final result. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more tutorials. Also watch other tutorials in my channel.